And so for my first video back, I wanted to do something that I normally don't do on my channel, but I'm going to start doing more on my channel, and that is cheap music review. So yes, um, for those of you who don't know, which probably is all of you, all 12 of you, <laughs> but um, I've been a percussionist for about 15 going on 16 years now. So, uh, but most people probably wouldn't have guessed that, maybe because of my playing style or the type of music I play. So I'm going to start uh, reviewing sheet music that I'm learning little by little to help you guys further along your uh, repertoire as well. So without further ado, let's get the show on the road. Soloist Folio. Um, I really like it uh, thus far. Um, this, I feel like this is a great um, booklet for a middle school or a middle school player or somebody who is just trying to get in the swing of learning how to read classical music. Um, well, maybe not just getting in the swing, maybe somebody returning to learning how to play uh, classical pieces and stuff like that. It has, it has a lot of little, um, fun pieces. For instance, um, I really like the, um, Hungarian Dance Number no. 5 by Brahms. Um, Rimsky's, um, uh, Flight of the Bumblebee is also in there. Uh, I kind of like the Coronation March by, uh, Maybear. I may be mispronouncing that. I'm sorry if I am, but I really like that. I think, um, Less Secret is pretty good, too. Uh, Dark Eyes is another good one. I like that one, too. And there's a couple of uh, four mallet um, um, pieces within, within the book. So um, it, it also has a component for to be a true solo, or um, if you would like to have an accompaniment uh, by piano, uh, there's also uh, sheet music for the pianist if you would want to be accompanied by a piano player so that is great um I would think I would give this out of five I think maybe maybe a solid maybe like a solid 3.5 out of five um I know that probably means nothing because you never heard me play or anything like that but um I think there's just some things within the the annotation of how the the xylophone or marimba part is written that the stickings I feel are sometimes a little bit unnecessary, not necessarily tricky, but a little bit unnecessary. Uh, whereas versus there's some parts where some pieces where I feel that um, there could have been uh, written in stickings. If, you know, just to suggest, you know how sometimes, okay, so sometimes in, uh, in I guess, percussion music, we have um, some stickings that are recommended or we have to do. And then there's sometimes the music is written in a way where it um, suggests how you should play it. And I feel like there's some pieces that definitely should have had a suggestion, like in the way it was written to how to play that uh, sort of piece. But, hey, it's all good. I mean, like, overall, I really, really enjoy the uh, the the um, sheet music, all of it. It's It's a lot of nice pieces that I think were really well picked, I think. If you are just learning, getting back into the swing of uh, of reading classical music, or you just want to up your repertoire in any any kind of in any capacity, this is definitely the book for you. Um, if you want to buy this, it's by uh, I don't know if you can see this. It's by uh, Hal. Okay, it's by Hal Leonard. Uh, it's an American um, uh, publishing a sheet music publishing company, so they sell a lot of different um, uh, publish 
what do you say? Publish sheet music? Publishment? I don't know. They sold a, a, a whole slew of kind of uh, sheet music. Um, so be sure to check them out. And Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to see my past cringy videos, that should be coming somewhere up on the screen. Uh, be sure to subscribe because I'm going to be coming out with... I'm not going to say a ton, but I'm going to be coming out with a, a lot more videos, a lot more content for you guys. I have so many ideas, so many uh, different things that I want to tell you guys um, about a whole bunch of different things. And um, if you want to see more of these videos, uh, be sure to comment down below to um, suggest any suggestions on what sheet music you think I should learn next. Any pieces that you think I should learn next. Uh, rate it for you guys, play it for you guys, put it on my channel, and all that good stuff. Well, I hope you're having a great day, a great week, and I'll see you next time. Bye.